Hello, I'm Eric Pratt from U.S. Broadcast Distribution, and today we're going to be talking about the Soliton Zhao S. Soliton is a Japanese-based company, and they make this tiny little bonding solution. This is an up to four-channel bonding solution capable of bringing in three modems and either a Wi-Fi or wired network signal. What is bonding? Bonding is a solution where you can use multiple carriers and methods to have added bandwidth and redundancy to increase the quality of your um, stability and the quality of your um, video signal. This particular unit is different from most bonding solutions in that it is an HEVC bonding device. And what does that mean? HEVC is a standard or a technology called H.265, or also known as H.265, which can be said one way to, de to have the amount of bandwidth for the same quality of signal or double the quality of signal on the same amount of bandwidth. So it's literally twice as good as H.264. So for people for whom which um, either bandwidth is an issue or quality is an issue, this is a product to take a really close look at. So let's take a close look at it. This is the unit up close, and it's got a nice little display here, and usually there's video here, which we'll see in a second when I actually hook video up. These are some buttons across the front to power it on and off and start and stop uh, encoding. On the top here, this is, um, we've got an HDMI input, an SDI input, a headphone, and then we have uh, three inputs for modems. And then this is the slot where you can either put a Wi-Fi dongle or you can attach, uh, there's an included Ethernet to USB device. So that will let you add wired to your bonding. So if you lose that wired connection, you can always fall back on your modems. Uh, there's also power on the side, and then there's um, uh, 3 8 mount on the back and then it's got this nifty little cage that it can sit in which has more mounting points and then it's also got uh, retention for cables so here's your modem and your SDI. So let's get the unit hooked up to its modems and get streaming and I can show you some of the really neat things about this product. So we've hooked the Zao S up to a bag of modems here and you might be asking yourself why a bag of modems? The Zao S is available with this really nifty organizational um, strap. So it's a strap that you put on yourself and it's got Velcro organizational slots so that you can put bags for holding things like batteries and modems and the unit itself attaches here using this, uh, this little housing which has strain relief in it and this is useful for mounting it on a camera as well because it provides strain relief for the modems and the SDI and it gives you uh, additional um, mounting points. So that's one of the ways that we can organize the, uh, the Zao S if you wanted to carry it around on your person and uh, attach the camera via SDI or HDMI. And then let's take a look at the unit itself streaming. So we can see that it's running at about 600 kilobits per second. It's connected to three different antennas. And then um, we also uh, can see that it's running at about 30 frames per second and we're bringing in a signal which is 59.94 interlaced. And it's live. And what does that mean? It's sending the video signal out through its different uh, antennas through three different networks and it's reintegrating them. How is it reintegrating them? Well, normal bonding solutions have this reintegration done in the cloud and you pay a yearly fee, sometimes a large monthly or yearly fee to reintegrate it in the cloud. And the disadvantage to this is that you really don't have control over how that's done or control over the video or its security. If you're working in um, a military or medical or governmental um, organization, you want to have that kind of, uh, you want to have control over the reintegration of these different signals, or even in the broadcast industry. The Zao S comes with a single channel of the 
um, HD Telecaster software, which we can see running here on the same system that we're recording this production on. So the software, this the Zao S, is being pointed at the IP address of this laptop that I'm recording everything on. And then it's taking, you can see the three different network streams and their, their stability. And it's taking those three different network packets and reintegrating them into a single NDI stream that I'm then feeding into vMix. So we can actually take something like a Turbo, which is a portable vMix system, run the reintegration software and the vMix software on it at the same time, making it really the world's first portable HD bonding live production system. Or if you're not using something like vMix, if you're using something like TriCaster, you can run this software on a um, server and then you can connect to the TriCaster or other NDI uh, live production system via network. Or if you're running a traditional switcher like an ATEM or a ROS or Panasonic, uh, something that's just taking in SDI, you can run that server with a Blackmagic uh, ATEM output so that you can connect to traditional um, HD switchers via SDI. And you can run, they have a, a four uh, a four, ver four input version software, so you can actually reintegrate four different remote bonded cameras simultaneously and output four different NDI or SDI signals. The version of software that comes with the Zao S is a single channel, and that's what we're running uh, remotely on the software that you can see here, which is very unique, and that's why I wanted to point it out to you. Um, just the fact that it comes with its own software and that you can deploy that on your own hardware is very important for some people because it has no further ongoing uh, expense and you have the total security of managing the entire infrastructure yourself. Um, so the Zao S is an amazing, uh, amazing little solution. Um, for doing bonding and remote production. And if you have any questions about it, please feel free to reach out to us. Uh, our website is usbroadcast.co. You can visit us at US Broadcast um, Distribution on Facebook or on our YouTube page to see more amazing videos just like this. Thanks for watching.